733 here on BT and we start with this active fire situation in the beach. It's a three alarm fire that has spread to multiple homes, destroying at least one. Our Karen Seolan is joining us live from the scene. This is near Queen and Woodbine where it's still a very heavy firefighter presence there. Good morning, Karen. Good morning, Tammy. Well, this st stubborn house fire on Kibben Davy Avenue continues to smolder. I'm going to step out of the way here to give you a look. What we know is that the flames rapidly spread throughout the entire house and then to two neighboring homes. However, while this is still an active fire, it is considered under control and fire crews tell me that they have contained the fire back to the home of origin. Now, uh, what I'm told also is that there are open voids in the ceiling that are really hard for fire crews to get at. It's too unsafe to go inside the ceiling to fight it. And so that's what you're seeing here. Fire crews are trying to hit those open voids where they can. The fire then uh, often will break through the ceiling, they say, but then crews hit it with an aerial apparatus. And again, that's kind of what you're seeing now. Uh, with the fire crews also on top of the ceiling there, just uh, actively monitoring those hot spots in what uh, they're calling the open voids in the ceiling. Now, nine people in total from the three homes uh, that were affected have been evacuated, including five people inside the house of origin. Here's more from Division Commander Steve Darling, who says, fortunately, there have been no injuries. Have a listen. We did a primary secondary search of the building. We found uh, no occupants and uh, everybody's safe, no report of injury. Yeah, it's hard to say where the fire started. We're going to do an investigation afterwards. There is an electric vehicle in there. It's, it's still too early to determine if it was involved. It doesn't look like it was involved at this point in time. But again, we'll have to do an investigation to make that determination. So as you heard from uh, Darling there, it's still too soon to know the cause of this fire. They will have to conduct an investigation once this fire is uh, totally uh, put out because, again, they are actively monitoring these hot spots and trying to uh, bring these hot spots under control because a very stubborn house fire here. It's still smoldering, uh, and the damage is very extensive. Uh, Darling says that the damage is extensive to all three homes. However, the house of origin, that's the one in the middle. It looks like it will have to be gutted. Fortunately, the structures of the other two homes are intact and they seem to be okay. All right, Karen Seolan live this morning on Kippen Davy near Queen and Woodbine. Thank you so much for that.